Hi learners, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today we'll do the part two, and that we'll see exercise one point two. So this says which of the following are not additive inverses of each other? So you know the additive inverses means now this is plus eleven by fifteen, so the inverse is going to be additive. That is going to be minus eleven by fifteen. Minus seventeen by twenty one. That is going to be plus seventeen by twenty one. Eight by minus nine is going to be this. Actually, eight by minus nine means this is plus and this is minus. So whenever plus divided by minus is going to be minus, or minus divided by plus also is going to be minus. So this is going to be overall that is going to be minus eight by nine. So this is plus eight by nine. So these are the additive inverses. They said which are not. So now see here, this both of them when we say minus divided by this minus is going to be plus. So this is overall this is going to be. Twenty-five by fifty-two, and this is also twenty-five by fifty-two. So this is not the additive inverse. Which among the following pairs are reciprocal? So reciprocal means now suppose now this is four. The reciprocal of four is going to be one by four. Or if it is one by four, that is going to be four by one. That is going to be four. So now this is twelve by seventeen. So it should be the reciprocal should be seventeen by twelve. So now this is minus minus means this is going to be plus. So this is going to be seventeen by twelve. So this is the correct option. So here you can see now minus thirteen by twenty seven. This is actually the opposite, but this is negative and this is positive. So this is not possible. Again here, this is not possible. So the option is A. The multiplicative inverse of so. If we take this one, this is going to be twenty-four minus minus becomes plus, so plus twenty-four divided by fifty-five. So the multiplicative inverse inverse is going to be fifty-five by twenty-four. Name the property and the multiplication used in each of the following. So now, see this is the left hand side because this is equal to sign in between, and this is the right hand side. So now what you can see the left hand side. So when we expand this one. So that is going to be five by eight into three by four, and this is going to be this is the plus sign. Five by eight into seven by eleven. So can you see here? So this is the distributive property of multiplication because this is multiplication over addition. Here this is the left hand side and this is the right hand side. So what we can see a into b into c, and this is again this both are same a into This and this is the same, so we can write B and this and this into C. So that is the associative property. Now this is the left hand side and this is the right hand side. So now what we can do here, the left hand side, if you this will be one and here also will be one, and this minus and minus becomes plus, so that is going to be one. So this is the multiplicative inverse. So. So this is going to be the answer for this is minus because minus nine by seventeen that is going to be so you don't have to think about this one. So this is the left hand side and this is the right hand side. So this will be multiplicative identity. So now this is the left hand side, and this is the right hand side. So what is that? A into B, and now this is A is here. So this is and this is the B. So we can say B into A. So that is commutative property of multiplication. So here you have to simplify. So now look at the denominator. This is a plus sign in between. So the denominator both are different. So we have to take the LCM of that. So when you take the LCM of twelve and fifteen, so this is going to be two six za fifteen, two three za fifteen, and this will be three one za and three five za, and this will be so fifteen, fifteen two za thirty and thirty two za sixty. So the LCM is going to be sixty. So what you can do here, twelve is already here. So twelve into five that is going to be sixty. So this is multiplied by five means this also the numerator also should be multiplied by five, 
So again here, this is 15 is here, 15 fours are 60. So this is multiplied by four. So it here also should be multiplied by four. So this is going to be minus 35 plus 52 by 60. So this will be 52 minus 35. That is going to be plus 17 by 60. This is the answer. Now look at this one. Again, the denominators are different. There is a plus. So first thing, what are you going to do? Plus and minus is going to be minus over here. This plus the same here. So if you take the LCM of this, you can check with the same method what I showed you earlier for this problem. So 8, 9, and 12, you will take the LCM of that. I have already done it. So that is 72 is the LCM of this one. So this is 8, 8, 9 is a 72. So this also should be multiplied by 9. Here is 9, 9, 8 is a 72. So this also should be multiplied by 8. So 12 is here. 12, 6 is a 72. So same thing should be multiplied over here. This is important. And plus minus is going to be minus. So now this is going to be minus 45 plus 64. And this is going to be minus 66. And the LCM is 72. So when you solve this part, minus 45 plus 64, minus 66, you get minus 47 by 72. Now let us see for this one. This is in the bracket. Let us solve this fast, uh, this one. So this will be again, we'll take the LCM because this is a plus in between. So we have to take the LCM of that and the LCM is going to be, you can just do with that method. So that is going to be 60. So 15 is already over there. So that will be 15 for the 60. So this also should be multiplied by 4. And plus minus is minus. So right here minus. And here 20 is here. 23 is a 60. So this also should be multiplied by 3. So now let us keep this in the bracket first. This same will keep it bring it here down so this is minus 32 minus 39 by 60 and now we'll remove the bracket multiply by minus 5 by 6 so this will be minus 32 minus 39 so minus 32 minus 39 so in this case what we have to do we have to add both of them whenever both are minus we will add this one so that is going to be 71 but we have to keep the same sign that is the negative sign so minus 71 by 60 into this 5 by 6 as it is minus 5 by 6. So 5 ones are 5 twelves are. So we cannot simplify it further. So that is going to be minus and minus C here. Be careful. That is going to be plus and 71 into 1. That is going to be 71. And sorry for this one. This will be 12. 6 are that is going to be 72 over here. This should be 72. Okay. So now let us go for this one. Uh, this is going to be 15. You know the mixed fraction how to do this one. You multiply this into this, that is going to be 15. And then whatever you get the answer, 15 plus 3, that is going to be 18. And this you keep as it is, that is going to be 18 by 5. Same here. This is here. We will keep this as it is. Same, this will be as it is. So now let us, because this is multiplication, we can simplify it. 5 ones are, 5 threes are. You can do as you like. Because in some cases, So here it will be two eights and two nines. So here we cannot simplify it further. So this will be, this is minus. So now let us keep this minus. When you multiply this, you get 351. And this is going to be 160. So now what you can see here, this is 351 by 160. So you know the numerator is bigger than the denominator. So this is improper fraction. So whenever you get improper fraction, you can make it to mixed fraction, 351 divided by 160. So this is going to be 320 and this will be 31. So that comes to, you have to go this way, the clockwise. So that will be two integers, 31 by 60. But this is a negative sign. So minus two integer, 31 by 160. So now here again, we can see here, this is a plus. 
sign here so the denominators are different so again here you also here you have to take the lcm of this one so when you take the lcm of 8 12 and 16 the lcm is going to be 144 so here 8 is the 8 into 18 is 144 so this also should be multiplied by 18 plus and minus becomes minus here again here we already have 12 12 into 12 is going to be 144 so this also should be multiplied by 12 here 16 16 nines are 144 so this also should be multiplied by nines but this is plus minus is going to be minus over here so 18 minus 6g minus 27 over 144 so when you solve this one this is plus so that comes to minus 69 by 144 so you can simplify this further so this will be divided by 144 divided by 3 so if you don't know the bigger numbers how to divide this one and simplify you can just use the find out the SCF of these two numbers and you know the SCF that is going to be the common factors you get common is 3 so here this is going to be minus 23 by this should be 48 48 threes are so that will be minus 23 by 48 so now let us see these are four numbers and there is a plus and minus sign in between so this when you take the lcm of these four numbers 12 3 4 and 6 so you get here 12 is the lcm of this so this remains as it is here this is 3 so you have to multiply it by 4 here is 4 you have to multiply by 3 here is 6 means you have to multiply by 2 same in the numerator whatever the changes plus minus is minus here plus minus is minus here rest all the same so now you can see the lcm is 12 so you will just take the numerator so 11 minus 4 minus 9 plus 14 so this is here so after solving this one you get 12 and the denominator is 12 so 12 divided by 12 that is going to be 1 now this is multiplication so what will you do you will simplify 3 1s are 3 4s are then this 4 and 4 goes off again this 3 and oh, sorry no, this is already got 3 1s and 3 4s are so here 3 remains so here minus and minus becomes plus and this is going to be 24 1 by 24 so now again this is multiplication so same thing is written here so seven ones are or we can do one thing here we can write here five fives are and five sevens are anyways you can do it also you can do your seven ones and seven fives are you're going to get the same answer so you have five fives are and five sevens are then seven ones are so this and this goes off so here will be six ones are and this is going to be six threes are so here what you can see this is also minus and this is also minus so minus divide but but here this is minus and here you can see here this is plus so minus divided by plus that is going to be minus so you can write here minus and now in the numerator eight into one into one that is going to be eight and this is going to be one into five into three that is going to be 15 so minus eight by 15 again here but here what you can see here this is multiplication and this is division so what will you do this first we will keep as it is and this whenever there is a division sign so that should be multiplied but since you have multiplied here so this number gets flipped over so this is going to be 10 by 35 so this is the important step when you change this from division to multiplication so this the right hand side whatever the number is that gets flipped over so here 8 ones are 8 twos are 2 ones are 2 fives are so you can see this one you can simplify this already all things are written here minus and minus becomes plus so here remains here 5 divided by this 21 again here the same but here is division so this should be multiplied and this number gets flipped over so that is going to be 8 by 9 so again you can simplify and see here 
So that is going to be here, you have the minus sign. So be careful with this minus sign because here is only minus here. So that is going to be 2 by 3. So by this one, we have completed today's work. Do like and subscribe to my channel so you get the notification of other parts. Thank you.